Greetings, my friends. I've told you many times about the Psalm 83 war, and I've told you it's imminent. I believe it's going to be either right before the rapture, Harpazo catching away, or right after, no one knows for sure. But all of Syria, of Israel's neighbors now, are threatening her. <clears throat> and Israel is so concerned that she's saying that there is a imminent chance of war with not just one, not just two, not just three, but all of her immediate neighbors surrounding her everywhere to attack her uh, without notice. And this, my friends, is the imminent upcoming, soon to be Psalm 83 war. And what will happen is, you see all this land here, all this territory around this big circled area, you see it all, all through here. Israel is going to wipe out her neighbors like she did in the 67 war and take all this land that you see is going to belong to teeny weeny Israel. She's going to expand immensely. And I believe taking all that extra land on top of all the natural gas and oil she's discovering right now may very well be the hook that God puts in Gog, Putin of Magog, Russia's mouth, and then draws Russia and Turkey and Iran and the North Africa countries and everyone else down to their death at the Gog Magog War. This time, though, Israel will have no chance to defend herself. Her back will be against the ocean at the Gog Magog War, and she'll think she's about to be destroyed. But God, in his imminent wisdom, in his mighty hand, as he did in the Bible days, will cause confusion in the army's camps, will cause natural disasters, calamities. They'll fight amongst themselves. They will be destroyed in a mass rout by God's hand, not Israel, God's hand. And then Israel will begin to know that who God is and eventually who his son, only son, Jesus Christ is. So this is just another sign that we are in the imminent, imminent, imminent last days of imminent Harpazo catching away and rapture, my friends. And this is news right out of Israel. And Christians in the world need to understand, especially here in America, but everywhere else, that soon the rapture is going to happen. And those who aren't ready will be left here for seven pure years of hell, where if God did not intervene, he said no flesh will remain alive. As it is, billions with a B will die the most grotesque, gruesome, awful, terrible, horrific, just mind-bogglingly bad deaths imaginable to man. It'll be a hellish nightmare for seven plus years where, again, most human beings will die grotesque, awful, terrible, horrific deaths. There's no need to go through all of that at all. Jesus Christ is your only hope, my friends. If you've never been saved, you're backslidden. Right now, you can pray the prayer, do the six steps I have in the box below the video, and get right with the Lord because no one knows the next, is, no one knows the day and the hour, no one's guaranteed any more time in your life. If you'd like prayer, contact me. I pray for you every day without fail. True Christians, witness and pray for the lost daily and share this video. I am being censored relentlessly all across social media. And look up, true Christians, our Egyptian draweth nigh. We fly soon. May God bless you. Bye.